Hi friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and today I'm going to give an introduction to the sheet metal walls in the Generative Sheet Metal Design Workbench in KTAV5. A wall refers to any section in a sheet metal design. There are two types of walls in KTAV5 and both the methods will be discussed. Creating a base wall is what I'm going to show you first. So assuming that you have already set the sheet metal parameters which I've discussed in my previous video, I assume that you have, as I'm assuming that you have already done that and I'm going ahead. So for creating the base wall, the first feature created while designing a sheet metal part is called the base wall. The other features are added to this base wall and remember that the parameters that you have set over here is going to affect whatever features and whatever walls that you're going to create in the this particular workbench here. The wall tool is used to create the base feature of the sheet metal component and to create the wall you have two options one is by going to walls toolbar and clicking on this particular icon here or going to insert walls and wall. Invoke your wall toolbar wall tool by any of the any of these methods. Once you're invoking you have the wall definition dialog box here and you have an option to do the sketch or you have an option to do the sketch previously. So I'm going to make a sketch over here. And I'm going to give a dimension for this. So it's 150. And this is uh, 75. This is 35. This height is 100. And this is, say, 40. So you have a properly constrained uh, sketch over here. Come out of the sketch, and you have the particular sketch right here. So I'm clicking on the wall tool once again. So you have an option to specify already existing profile. So once you click, you have an option of uh, the wall which is being created. You have the preview of it. So another way is by making the sketch already when you're on the tool. So I'll just delete this particular sketch right here and I'm going to the wall option and then I'm going to the sketch here and then I'm going to give a sketch which is inside the wall tool so similarly you can uh, give some dimension and you can create a profile and you, you can properly constrain it and you have this particular preview of it so and uh, you have few more options here you have a sketch at extreme position sketch at middle position and invert material side i'm going to explain all of them now and you have uh, once you click on this uh, particular sketch at middle position what happens is the sketch will be applied in the mid position and the thickness will be distributed in both the directions here and you don't have an option for inverting the material side and once you click on this sketch at extreme position what happens is you have an option of uh, inverting the material side so that's how you can uh, create the wall in the generative shape design gen generative shape metal design workbench in KTAV5 so I hope uh, this video has helped you and uh, thank you so much for watching